Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Freedom Planet 2 with me Matt. As they were leave, we're now gonna do the robot jungle thing. The robot wars. Safe bet it's Carol doing her Carol thing. If it is, I'll sniff her out! Retrieve her safely, but do not forget what she has done. Well, in we go! Let's see how this will turn out as Nero then. I'll definitely take a shield early, that's gonna help. Ooh, double shield, okay. The shields do stack now, I found. Let's go over there, that thing, that's, those things are annoying. Do, do. Yeah, way deep into the jungle here. We love that little funny interaction, but now we have to deal with uh, Serpentine's forces. And they are generally a lot harder, I've found. Oh, well, they're just more aggressive, really. Oh god, I do love that they are fighting each other. That's gonna buy some time. like the only one who's thinking logically here. Come on, here we go. We lose that shield though, but we get another shield right here. Oh, okay. There we go. Gotta keep moving quick. What's all these mushrooms? Did you just have big mushrooms in Avalos? I suppose so. And I lost my shield again. Oh god, I suck at avoiding these bombs. There we go. But I keep moving through. Oh, we got the speed thing. I'm pretty, yeah, this is the speed thing. Let's look how much faster we're going with it. And avoid the missiles again. There we have R. So we are getting very close to the boss fight. Ah, I keep hit running into the bombs. Well, we got to the boss at least. Oh, that works. Okay. Wait. Damn it. Ah, 
I, I found it hard to deal with actually a knee right found. And he hit himself. Fine by me. I think we got him in a loop where he hits himself. Well, not that, not that time, unfortunately. Almost had him. And we got him! That was actually pretty quick! Wow! That went a lot faster than I expected. Oh, to Nanao Lake. Syntax is here too? It's like... Well, it's like a jungle in here. Hey, get away from her! She's mine! Oh, but she's very dangerous. You should let us big sisters take care of her. No! She's the heart of my latest greatest buddy yet! The BFF 3000! With her as the conduit, all three combiners can be operated by a single pilot! Maximum action, maximum firepower, maximum... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Where did she go? I get the feeling we're about to find out. Hello indeed! <laughs> so kind of you to fix my throne for me, monkey boy. Hey! No fair cheating, you cheater! I am not cheating! I'm just smarter than you, and now nothing will stop me from... <laughs> <laughs> when Murga shows up, we're gonna wake up Bakunawa, and she's gonna take me to outer space! Space! Ha! Looks like we've got a junior astronaut here. Then join me. The great and generously giving Lord Brevin is always looking for new recruits. Don't listen to him. His offers are steeped in lies and deceit. Oh, uh, yeah! Stop it! And you, you dog! I repeat my offer! Or would you rather your friends learn the truth? What truth? That you're a miserable snake? Join me, little one. You may yet live to see your parents. So you're not only a cheat, but a liar, too. Brevin sure knows how to pick them. Fine! Then witness the power of a fully operational syntax! Initiate code, code black! As you wish, sir. No! My playmates! <laughs> yes! The infection is perfection! Your army is mine now! Go forth! Eliminate them! <laughs> in light of our mutually assured destruction, I believe a truce is in order. Okay, probably my least favorite level, personally. I think it's a bad level or anything, it's just not as good as others uh, I found. Music is great though. I need to move quick here. Do, 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 do. So many of Brevin's units. Yeah, we're definitely not fast at all with Nia. There we go. I do like that, that stance though when she's grinding underwater and rails. Looks very dignified and very superior. He's a very superior woman. Not everyone can be a superior woman like Nira can. Ooh. 
We're gonna move quick here. Now we need to find a robot parts, I think. Oh, that's a shield. Huh? I want that. Well, the shield's not gonna last for long like this. Never mind, double shield. Uh, lots of enemies. Oh god. Wait, does she walk on water when she has the power up too? Like just slowly walking? That, that would actually be an interesting thing for that uh, that power up briefly, as long as you have it. Well, that's one part. There we go. Ah, horns, horns everywhere. Let's get some air. There we go. Last one is up there. Got it. Hmm. I suppose that works. But we got that at least. Not be serious. <laughs> song and dance routine is required for this thing to function. Get out of my sight, I thought. Activate. I love that. That's what causes the monster activate. Obviously, <laughs> very good timing on the com comedy. And now for giant robot time. I think the food is pretty fast. I think. I might actually have time to do one more level, even though it'll be <clears throat> in the next chapter. Well, not really the next chapter, but the next mission. But I think that's fine that I can do uh, to at least some part of the first one. Is that I think I might be able to time it somewhat nicely. Okay, let's do all these. There we go. Do, 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 do. I'll say, uh, Servitude's army got quite big. Okay. Oh, that did a lot of damage. Back, there we go. Okay. I think I'm getting the hang of this mech fight a little bit. Somewhat. Up there. There we go. There we go. <laughs> See, I'm, I'm getting a good hang of this. Victory! <laughs> and now what's yours is mine! Huh? Where did my playmates go? Guys? Hello? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah! <laughs>
<laughs> I do like that. That was a little mean. Was kidnapping Mayor Zhao and having a hand in Shang Tu's downfall not also a little mean? I'm just glad that's over with. Lilac, about what Serpentine said. It's okay. You don't have to say anything if you don't want to. I'd trust you over Snake Man any day of the week. And when you're ready to talk, I'll be here. It shows good friendship between now, the three heroes. Let's go find Carol. Well, Nira is not really part of the trio yet, but I suppose she'll become part of it at some point. Yeah, Nira is a little bit above it by the feels of it. All right, we can just uh, go up and do the next one now. So we go in here, and then we pick the final mission: Justice in the Sky Paradise. This was on the news before you arrived. Brothers and sisters of Perusa, I, Captain Kalau, have returned to resolve your looming volcanic crisis. With the power of geothermal science and my superb physical strength, I shall divert all of that harmful subterranean pressure and siphon it into the sea, where it shall be rendered harmless. Worry not and rejoice, good citizens. The Red Wing of Justice is on the case. <laughs> Something doesn't feel right about the captain's plan. And the signs they've got seem to bit off. Well, besides that, Captain Cornball over there has been setting up beacons all over the island. Probably all a part of his egotistical plan. Ooh, shiny! Bip, bip, bip! They can't be for anything benign. Let's seek them out and disable them. Post haste. That we shall! Do, 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 do. Could the captain earnestly be trying to save his people? If so, then perhaps it is not too late for him to see reason. You ladies be careful! Yep, up we go to Skybridge. I do love the music in this one. Doo -doo -doo. I just noticed you can actually see a lot of stuff in the distance. Like, you can see the stuff from a titled gate in the distance over there. And I believe you can see Shang Mu. It might be Shang Mu. That's at least what I think it is. There we go, got some good hits in there. There we go. Now it's gonna get out of you, I think. No! Oh my god! You can see it, okay. Yeah, so I think there's Title Gate in the distance and Shang Mu in the far distance. That's a really cool backdrop. I've only, only just noticed it was probably Shang Mu. <laughs> so much detail in this, that's why I love it. Doo, doo, doo. Right, we need to get back up. We need to stay on this thing. There we go. Do 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 do. Such a pretty place. I still wonder who designed it though. Like near, I still believe recognize the symbols potentially with Indian Sisal Forge, which makes me think it might be Earth Dragon, because she works for the Magister, so she probably sees a lot of her. Earth Dragon symbols around. Uh, no. Never mind. Let's get over here then. And wait for it to come back. Very calm music. There we go, first beacon. Now we need to get rid of this, this thing. We can't freeze that, makes sense, it's too big. There we go, that works. Now we need to deal with this thing. 
It's like an elemental thing. There we go. Oh, come on. There we go, got it. The fact that Nero doesn't flinch when she has focus activated really means you can just pull out a herd on enemies I found. Ah, oh, we missed the bonus. That doesn't really matter, though. I'm not really a completionist in the same sense. So, uh, I mostly care about completing the game and having fun while doing it. And just having a good time. But I found Nero does do a lot of damage. Do, 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 do. I really hope they make it Freedom Planet 3 now, because Freedom Planet 2 is just so good. They might make, make DLC for Freedom Planet 2, though, which I'd be all for. They can also reuse really a lot of these sprites, because uh, these sprites, I think, will just last for a long time. They're really good sprites, after all. And the animation quality is just top tier as well. Do, 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 do. I wonder who put these rocket things here. Probably the locals, though. Yeah, that's, this is probably a local thing they set up. And bam. Okay, that actually hurt a lot. Uh, hurt him a lot during that attack. And now we have to wait for this thing to come back, though. No, oh, there's a second one, okay. Is this just the same one? Ah, oh, it's the same one, it's not that long of a trip. There we go, last beacon. Damn it. Did mistime that. There we go. Now the elemental. Damn it. I should have pissed up there so I could do the cyclone thing. Come on, Nira! To be honest, this thing is not much of a threat, it's just taking a while. There we go, good job. Hold it right there. Here he comes! I recognize that sanctimonious tone of voice. What? It's just you? Well, I suppose you will have to do. Say your absolute worst villain. Go on. Let everyone see you for the splenetic Shangtusian terrorist that you are. Your monstrous attacks on peace will be broadcast on every channel in Perusa. And I, Captain Kalau, will be the legendary hero who strikes you down. The pretext for your betrayal revolves around pandering to your overinflated ego. I shall be very cross. Close up, please. <laughs> because it is. Now witness the Red Wing of Justice reborn! This calls for a boss duel! He might have to be very easy in the first part here, but he just laid the traps. And he runs into them. Ah, oh, that destroys them, okay. Ah. I love this guy. <laughs> Mighty wind, 
The first part done. Now you've done it. I am the terror. For justice! <laughs> okay, this might be a little bit more problematic for us, though. Actually, you do pretty good like this in the upwinds. Ah, it's just getting to him. Ah, damn it. There we go, like that. Actually, when we're in the air, we can just do that. Yeah, because we, are, we can do the thrust in the air. And here is definitely not made for aerial air combat, though. But it works! I guess Nira said it best. You're a pathetic. Impossible. Justice has fallen this day. You are no avatar of justice. Merely its pretender. Incorrect, villain. Murga relayed to me the horrid tale of the Magister's foul crimes against this world. To fight against such inequity, I, Captain Kalau, would become the hero that Avalis deserves. I see. So being the Battlesphere champion was not enough for you. You had to play at being a real hero as well. <laughs> Battlesphere champion. What kind of hero sits in a playground all day, waiting for evil to come to him? I am a joke, an action figure. A fake legend prancing around for my beloved citizens' amusement. As if I could care any less about them sitting at home, stuffing their faces, watching me grapple for sport. But not anymore. This time, I will be the hero. This time, I will be the one who saves the world. And no one is going to stand in my way! <laughs> Which is what Captain Kalau would say had Captain Kalau been brain sucked by villainous Shang Tujian terrorists. Yeah, no one's gonna buy that. But fear not, good citizens. I, Captain Kalau, the Red Wing of Justice, have broken free of their dastardly programming and will live on to fight another day. Yeah! A fitting conclusion for a charlatan champion. <laughs> Good, well said, Nero. That wild sky pirate is making her way to the tower. Corey, I'm on my way. There's no time. I must reach the scoundrel before her ship takes off again. I understand. Good luck. Oh, okay. That's cool, though, that Nira and Lilac seem to understand each other. They're a little bit more professional about this whole thing, being enlisted in the military service. Anyway, in the next episode, we'll do all the passing up to Bakunawa itself. I'll see you then, everyone. Bye-bye!